Hello everybody, this is Shirley from Shirley's Real Life. Welcome to the SRL community. I hope all of you are doing well on today. I'm here to do a, a coloring page completion for my Thanksgiving and my uh, <clears throat> November um, coloring pages. I didn't do very many pages, you guys. Uh, things got a little hectic and busy a, a little bit for this month, but I'm thankful that I was able to do this. So I'm going to put this up today. Happy Thanksgiving, happy day before Thanksgiving. And I hope everybody is getting ready for um, their families and friends to enjoy and be grateful and thankful for all of that. I appreciate all of you being here and coming to spend a few minutes with me. And you guys can continue to cook, continue to do whatever you're going to be doing for Thanksgiving. And I'm going to show you this. Uh, I have three books only. And I have four pages. So it's not going to be very long at all. And we're going to get started with the uh, the Mastic Mouse book for today. We're going to go straight to it, guys. And this is one. At first, I had an idea. I was not really sure of what I wanted to do with this. But his Thanksgiving is enjoying and relaxing with his block of cheese. I guess he's coloring or writing, whatever he's doing. But he is enjoying his day. And this is what uh, I got out of this picture. He's resting and relaxing and chilling at home, eating his cheese, giving thanks for whatever has been blessed for him on, you know, this Thanksgiving. So that is what I did. I used um, Star Joy to do this coloring with. All of my oranges and greens and, and my little browns in between here. I added a couple of blue colors to it. But that is my chilling with cheese. There you go. Okay, guys. And my next one is going to be Autumn Harvest. And that book was done by Morgan O'Brien. This one is done by Teresa Goodrich. I love her her artwork. No matter which book I get of hers, it's always really nice. This is Autumn Harvest. And we're going to go straight to that one. Hello, Autumn. I will go back. Excuse me, y'all. My little <laughs> great-granddaughter ran in and had to... Move it out. She's excited today for whatever reason. I don't know. But uh, here we go. This one right here. I'm going to pull it back. Here we go, guys. I'm going to hold it up a little bit so you can see it. We have also Star Joy. I did this with that one. And we have a pumpkin cooling in the window. Hello, Autumn colors are, came out very pretty this is I used a um, the ink pens or, or markers and it came out like this it is gray and I used the orange and those are um, color pencils well color marking pencils and all the rest of it is star joy coloring pencils Your little berries, your little pie. I assume maybe it's an apple pie or something. I'm not sure. It could be a pumpkin pie, but usually they don't put the uh, the breading on like that. But you know, everybody do differently. So this is the uh, one I did for. Um, the common pie or the uh, cooling pie. <laughs> there you go, guys. 
I like the colors. It is similar to the one that's in the booklet because she had done one in the book. I'm going to show you that hers. And I did a lot of different little thingies. The um, pie plate came out a little different. Mine's is blue. Hers is, is white, but it has a little blue in it. My uh, my grapes are a little uh, darker than hers. Her can, it looks silverish like, but it's it's got a little blue on it as well. So here we go. It is a little similar, but not not a lot. She just uh, our flowers are almost the same, but I have a little more orange in my flower than she does in hers. The curtains are blue. The vase is blue, but there's a little similarity to it, but a lot of difference as well. So there you go, guys. That's the one I did for this book, Autumn Harvest. And the last book will be Autumn Charm. And I like this book too. It's very, very nice artwork in it. And it's by Teresa Goodrich as well, by Create, from Creative Haven. And I'm going to show you the one I did in here. Well, I did two in this one. But here we go with the uh, Happy Thanksgiving. And those are the colors that I came up with. I thought they were, well, Thanksgiving-y, also kind of fallish like for this year, the weather. Um... The flowers, well, the leaves actually came out pretty good. I'm going to bring it down so you can see the top part of it on, on the board. Got a little uh, board building board back here. It says Happy Thanksgiving. And when you get down here, I didn't know exactly what colors to color in here. I will have to go back. I, didn't, I had even forgotten about that one. I'll go back and, and do it. It'll probably turn out to be a brownish color. I don't know yet. I actually forgot about that. But anyway, everything came out nicely as far as the corn is concerned. And you got the flowers here, the sunflower uh, flowers. <laughs> yeah. And the leaves on the turkey. So they made the turkey out of uh, the leaves and a pumpkin. And I thought that was so cute when it when I saw the page. So we'll go to the next page. Happy Thanksgiving, you guys. I hope all of you, again, is enjoying and stay safe out there. Very safe. And this is the last page out of the four pages that I've done. This is a Thanksgiving feast. You have the pie. You have all the fruits. The pilgrim hat. The corn. And the turkey. You have a little cider in the middle. I guess it's an apple cider. Or whatever you would imagine <laughs> it to be in your mind. So, yeah, guys, happy Thanksgiving again. Actually, stay safe. Have fun. Let everyone know how much you love them and appreciate them. And thank God for being able to open up your eyes on today. Thank you, guys. God bless.